Hey gang, Obi-Wan back again with another review, this time of the Lego Lone Ranger set 79109 and it's the Kobe or Colby City Showdown um, from obviously from the Lego Lone Ranger movie. This box is a bit beaten up, I actually got this second hand, um, I actually had to get it off eBay, um, obviously it's out of production, pretty sure the movie's about five or six years old now. But, I love westerns, and it is New Year's Eve, so I'm trying to get this review done for New Year's Day, and why not build this, because I've been wanting to build this set for ages. So, let's get into a time-lapse build of this awesome set, and let's check out the minifigures, and I'll do a full review and comparison at the end. Let's get into it right now. Hey guys, just finished the time lapse. What an amazing set this Colby City Showdown really is. Um, as far as the build goes, I had a heap of fun. I really like the buildings. Um, you get two, I mean, it's it's not a mega amount of bricks, but I mean, you get a bank. You also get the sheriff's office. They look authentic. They're not overkill. They're just perfect. And you get five awesome minifigures. Um... I'm really, really happy with this set. Um, I would definitely pick it up. It also has a lot of cool play features. Um, if you're a young kid, it would, you know, it'd really, really be a cool set to get if you're into your Western stuff. So let's go through the minifigures, and then we'll go through the bank and the sheriff's office, and then we'll wrap up the review. Okay, guys, the minifigures. So, of course, you get Tonto, which is Johnny Depp, of course. You also get the Lone Ranger. Um, Tonto and the Lone Ranger, you actually get in quite a lot of sets. So, they're not the main draw card for this set, but it is awesome that you do get the two main characters if this was the one set you were going to buy. Um, what is the draw card is you get Dan Reed, which is um, uh, the Lone Ranger's brother. You also get Ray... Frank. Now, they all come with the cool Western hats. They all come with cool Western weapons. Um, this is back when, um, you know, you weren't getting the shooters with the studs. So, very authentic. Um, the figures look amazing. Um, let's do a little quick back view and then we'll take off the hats and we'll check over the heads and we'll go through each minifigure individually. Okay, all the figures have some nice back printing on them, not too overkill. So, of course, the only one that has a different variation of the head is the Tonto. So, if you've had a Lego Lone Ranger set before, you would know this, but the bird comes off, the hair comes off, and then we have a different head. Okay, so we've got the scary face, and then we've got kind of the nervousy, smiley type of face. Let's just have a closer look at Tonton. Awesome printing on there. I called him Tonton, sorry. Tonto. <laughs> I've been watching too much Star Wars. Okay, and then we put his hair back on. And then we put the little crow back on top of his head. Okay, the Sheriff's Office, let's go over this quickly. Um, it comes with a nice wanted sign there. Obviously, the door opens. Now, what it does have is it has quite a few play features. I really enjoy the build on this. Like I said before, it's basic, but it really will um, add to your western town if you're wanting to build and have a, you know, a decent little western town going on. So let's flip it to the back and we'll have a look. You've obviously got the jail cell. And you've got a little bit of a counter here where you can sit and you can, um, you've got your guns and your weapons and your handcuffs. Now, what I will show you is this here is got a bit of dynamite. And this is so that you can break out people that are in the jail. So what you do is you push this and it blows the jail out. So then you can rescue whoever's in the jail. Pretty damn cool play feature, that one. There's also another play feature 
up top. I'll just get to that. I'll pop this back in. So that was really easy just with that pin. So now what we have, as you can see the cannon up there, what we have is that actually flips down and then the cannon can be shot. And you have all your uh, pellets in there for the cannon. Okay, so pretty cool sheriff's office. I'm happy with it. Let's get to the bank and let's wrap up the review. Okay, the bank, awesome build. Um, obviously the door opens. Uh, no little tricks with up top here. There's some lights, nice little, um, you know, decking out the front. I mean, you can add more to it if you, if you feel like you want to, but it looks like a bank. It looks like a bank from the Western era. I think they've done a pretty good job with, with authenticity. Um, we have a little uh, security sticker there that shows some golds and things in there. What we've got here is if we go all the way to the back, we have a safe. These doors close. Okay, and then the doors open up like so and we have all our money in there now there is a little play feature here this little button here what you do is you flick that and you can see this wants to come down pop and you can steal all the treasure well not treasure but all the stuff that's in the bank so gold and money of course uh, then you have like room for where the teller would be and I mean all in all it's got the little chandelier if you've seen the, lo uh, the Lone Ranger that's you know one of the typical things that they shoot down it comes down and yeah I mean look it is small but what it does do is it adds to your western city and I think it's a decent little build definitely going to add to your western city the whole lot is good um what would i do i would definitely get it i would definitely purchase it now because it's going to go up um there's a couple other little items i'll just go through you get this little uh horse and charity type of thing which is nothing too fantastic um but yeah it has some uh, monies in the back and uh so that's that and you also get one of these little bad boys which you can add to your western city as well so nothing too exciting about that but what is good is these two babies and of course all the awesome minifigures so that's the review definitely pick it up guys i really enjoy the set so thanks and i'll see you on another review